up February 4th, and our next guest will be there nominated for Best R&B Album for her album, Special Occasion. Yes. So, I love this because this is actually New York City native Emily King's fourth, count them, one, two, three, fourth Grammy nomination. No for her unique blend of R&B, soul, funk, and folk, Emily King has toured the superstars like Nas, John Legend, Alicia Keys, Shaka Khan, Erica Badu, and Maroon 5. But the tail fam, you've got a front row seat to her performance right now. Today, please welcome Grammy-nominated artist Emily King! This year, 2024, 2020, more. You're kicking it off with more Grammy nominations. Oh my God. I Thank mean, you. what a beautiful time. I gotta tell you, um, this album is so beautiful, but I wanna highlight the lyrics that I love in this song. This year's gonna be about me. Never will I have another reason to doubt me. This year, I'm taking what's mine. Yeah. yeah. Not stealing. No, we're not taking anything. The lyric didn't say stealing. No, it said, I'm take taking. Make sure it's yours. Like, I love it. It's earned and deserved. Yes. Right? Yes. Take me to this space of creating this, by accident, album in some ways, meaning the title of it, but also it was at a relationship moment yeah. uh, that a relationship was ending. Yeah, it was interesting because um, I have a very long history with my musical partner, and we were also very much in a relationship together. Yeah. And so um, it wasn't, um, it was, we, we broke up and then we had to keep making the music together. Right. So, it, um, but I'm very grateful for that because right. I think that is the true expression of love, you yeah. know, and- But um, you can keep going. I love that you said this is not a breakup album. This was a moment in my life. Yeah. We created this beautiful art together and it has to live, it can't stop. And here you are with it. Well, that's what was amazing to me was that we were able to keep creating yeah. and um, our love for music as well. But it definitely was not what I expected it to be. It was very... Well, that's uh, why this show is Twists and Turns. <laughs> yeah. I mean, we, we call this show Twists and Turns because you don't know you what's don't going know. to happen. But yeah. I do know that music is in your blood. I mean, you grew up on the Lower East Side of New York, mm -hmm. both parents musicians. Yes. Yes, they were both um, singing around the house and playing gigs, and we would be backstage and hearing them sing the American Songbook and yeah. Duke Ellington and, and all this amazing music. So you really had no choice. You've got two parents. There's a jazz duo, and you're walking around the house, cute little Emily. They're like, you better do something with music, ma'am. Well, I, I remember I wanted to be a basketball player. You did? Yeah. And, do you have game? Because um, the New Yorkers uh, take their games. You know, I, I, have a, I have one shot. But you, I, I, I remember taking layups and, and I always missed the game point. Yeah. So I remember my father was, he, he introduced me to people as a singer. And I said, oh, maybe I'm not a basketball player. <laughs> I, think, I think he's recognizing my actual talent. Right. You know? So you had one shot, didn't work out, but this worked out. Congratulations. One shot. I love that. Thank you. <laughs> this shot worked out. Grammy, have you, have you thought about what you're wearing on the Grammy red carpet, all of that? Um, yes, I have worried about it. <laughs> and I have a wonderful um, aunt, uh -huh. Aunt Kathy, who's helping me to find, because she's in fashion, she's oh. helping me to find my outfit. Okay, shout out Aunt Kathy. Shout we'll be watching Kathy. on the red carpet, but more importantly, we'll be watching when they call her name.